Well, it looks to me like we have another fake natty on our hands. What is up, my skinny legends? Welcome to Kenny KO, where you are guaranteed to be triggered. And yes, from the intro, you can tell the natty or not videos are back. Today, we have a female athlete by the name Krista Nunn. And I'm gonna be honest, I actually had no idea who she was previous to this being sent to me. For entertainment purposes, we're gonna go ahead and call her the nun for this video. Just a little disclaimer to avoid myself getting in any more lawsuits. This is all gonna be my opinion. This is all constructive criticism. Let's go ahead and dive into it. So right off the bat on Kristen Nunn's profile, you can see no sponsors, no discount codes, no online programs. You should probably also include in there though, soon to be caught fake natty. But Kenny, how do you know she's not natural? She could just be that freak phenomenon athlete out there. Well, you little keyboard warrior, let's go ahead and show you the post I'm talking about. A couple days ago, Kristen uploads this picture proof is in the pudding debate it all you want was the caption hashtag i don't inject testosterone and just to give it as plain and simple and straight to the point is essentially what this is guys is lab results showing that kristen nunn tested as a natural athlete to put it plain and simple straight to the point what i thought was interesting though is as i touched on i didn't know who she was as an athlete as a person or anything previous leading up to this post being sent to me. So I saw the hashtag, I don't inject testosterone and wanted to dive deeper into it. Maybe she just doesn't inject testosterone and people were accusing her of that and she takes all these other different things. Now what I found highly suspicious or sus was the fact that she removes a ton of comments and I was staying up to date with this, watching, refreshing as new comments were coming in. As soon as there was a comment that was somewhat controversial or brought up a great point against the nun, it was instantly removed and they were either blocked or you know they weren't able to comment from that point on. As I just touched on, that was a very suspect part for me. Jumping back to that point I was just touching on, does she just not only inject testosterone and take other things? I wanted to dive deeper into the comments, see if people were asking the exact question that was on my mind and what she would respond. And through looking, just as I'm on my phone right now literally doing this, it seems to be that she's claiming natural of everything, not just testosterone. And not just claiming natural at this moment, she is claiming lifetime natural, which is a whole nother game. So let us just go ahead and give our opinion to the nun here. I don't know who the f you think you're fooling, but you are not natural. I mean, it's great you tested negative for taking testosterone, but does that mean as an athlete in the female industry, you're not taking SARMs, pro-hormones, other compounds. There are so many compounds of gear out there, guys. There's not just testosterone. In fact, testosterone isn't even really a popular compound among females. The most popular is gonna be Anivar, which is very mild in the grand scheme of things, hence why a lot of females will take it. Just to make this clear, once again, this is all my opinion. I just do not think there is any possible way this lady is natural. And she could have just posted some heated comments saying she's a lifetime natural. I don't know, I haven't talked to her personally in DMs, conversation, phone call. Kristen, if you're watching this video, I always open my platform up for anyone to defend themselves. If you wanna claim as a lifetime natural and just say at this moment you're natural. I also wanna make it known this isn't at all to bash her physique, regardless, natural, unnatural incredible and i say incredible physique for a female it's still mind-blowing she blows my physique away but everything circles back to that point and the emphasis of this video is the physique natural apologies i had to hydrate before i say this i'm sorry if you're a fan of the nun but that is not attainable naturally for a female it should also be stated that people are going to look drastically different on their social media versus in person so of course she'll be taking great photos but her photos are just so over the top that i don't think it's photoshop i obviously know they're under great lights and with a great pump but that physique that physique in my opinion isn't attainable naturally you guys might agree you might disagree by the way, many of you may have noticed that there is now a join button, which should be located, I believe, close to the subscribe button. What that essentially is, is a members only button. And to give an even bigger reward on top of becoming a member of the Kenny KO channel, anyone that becomes a member and leaves a comment on any of my videos, those are the comments I'm gonna pin at the top. Along with you get member only perks, you get exclusive access to my live streams once a month where I can answer all your questions. 
and you need to be a member in order to get into these live streams. So that's just a little update in case you guys weren't aware that that's now a feature on my channel. Jumping back to the nun, I wanna know your thoughts on the whole subject. So make sure to leave that in the comments down below. If you guys are new to the Kenny KO channel, I hope you subscribe. I hope you got enjoyment out of this video. If you did, please make sure to smash that like button. And if there's anything I want you guys to take away from this video, please, please, please be real and genuine and don't be a fake natty. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace. Yeah.